Hey, what's up everybody? This is Brian over here at the Little Orchard Farm. And today we're getting started a little bit late because of some rain that moved through the area last night and into the early morning this morning. But uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's still a, a beautiful morning for us, for me. Um, it's a week before Thanksgiving. And so, uh, man, we're, we're, we're blessed to be out here and being able to do this. And I encourage you to stay tuned to the end of the video today. We're going to be doing something incredibly special that's going to strengthen this cabin beyond anything that you've ever seen before. So stay tuned to that. Uh, but in the meantime, let's get busy building walls. Let's do this. We're building up our three walls with nothing but studs on them. As you can see, we got one of them up, and we've got another one going here, and then we'll build another one here. None of these have headers on them, so they go up pretty quickly, so it makes it easier on me. <laughs> episode of living and learning with Brian and Karen if you fail to plan you plan to fail if you fail to plan you plan to fail we're at that very last bedroom and we're we're looking at the way the door opens into the bedroom and on my on my not so um, uh, was it called uh, on our white prints yeah as opposed to our blue prints yeah on the white print that is not to <laughs> scale there's enough room to fit three king-size beds in this bedroom <laughs> but in reality 
I don't think there's enough room to fit the, a full, uh, you know, a single or a full size bed in and, and open the door effectively. So that's what we're that's what we're doing is we're trying to go back through and kind of think through um, if we want a bed and a little nightstand and how's the door open, will we have the right the right deal? And I think we're going to change it. So the living and learning for today is that having good blueprints versus white prints is the way to go. Is that right? Yes. <laughs> blueprints are better than white prints. I like it. Let's, let's recap. Blueprints are better than white prints. But also understand that change is inevitable. And while you may plan everything out to the T, there's always going to be change. Your ability to adapt and adjust, I think, are just as important as the blueprint. Living and learning with Brian and Karen. All right. Man, what a difference, uh, you know, the overnight makes uh, yesterday really overcast and cloudy and yucky. The rain had moved in and, and I had just been moving out uh, that afternoon when Karen and I got so much of our work uh, done yesterday. This morning, it's, uh, it's crisp, uh, probably uh, low 40s right now. Um, but the sun is out and, uh, man, it's going to be a, a terrific day, uh, for, uh, for Karen and I to kind of knock out the rest of these internal walls that we've got. So we're going to start, we're going to start on the wall that we, uh, we, uh, finished up with yesterday. Actually, it was funny cause I think we had about another hour or so of, of work to be done, but, uh, uh, the old generator here ran out of gas. So, uh, had to go get that refilled this morning and, uh, and we're back up and running. So we're going to, we're going to get this wall framed up and then we got to put some blocks up so we got to do some blocking um in uh on some of these walls that we forgot but hey it's gonna be a great morning let's get busy Tremendous amount of progress today. What do you think, babe? Uh, yeah. We're out though, aren't we? Yes. So what are we gonna do next time? Um, what do we got left? We gotta finish the bathroom wall, the closet wall, the two headers, and then we gotta put something over the top. Top plate. Top plate. We gotta do top plating. And then uh, we gotta do the sheeting. Yes. This is a good day. This is a good weekend. We got a lot knocked out, didn't we? Yes, we did. All right. Now then, to show you, as promised, the little section here where I was gonna—I told you that uh, 
Uh, there is, uh, we've got something that is going to protect this house like you have never seen before. And I'm going to show you that here now. Um, and, uh, yeah, I think you're going to like it. So there you have it. That's our insurance policy. Uh, that's what we rely on. My wife and I as Christ followers, we're not getting o overly um, uh, religious here on this channel, but we, but this is important to us. It's part of our journey. I mean, we could have hidden this from, from you guys as we built this along, but for us, I think it's important uh, that we have, you know, as we chronicle this build, that we have uh, this as a memento, uh, as a memento of things that uh, that we've that we've done and that we've accomplished. And so, you know, if if placing scripture um, on our um, on our framing, um, uh, I hope that doesn't offend anybody. But if it does, <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> but this is this is what's important to us. This is how we uh, we are honoring uh, we are honoring our God uh, in all the things that we do. Um, in fact, uh, there's another great piece of scripture. There's a wonderful piece of scripture over here. And this is probably my favorite verse of all. I don't know if you can read it, but. Whatever you do, work at it with all your heart as if working for Christ and not human masters. Colossians 3.23, it's my favorite verse. Hey, thank you very much for joining us this weekend as we continue to build our homestead from the ground up. We're so glad that you joined us. And if you're new, hey, make sure you hit the subscribe button below and ring that bell. And by the way, give us a like. That, that really would help us out. Love for you to join us on uh, on next week's as we continue to build up and build out the cabin structures. We're getting closer to the sheathing side of things, and so uh, hopefully we'll have this thing dried in in a few weeks. But until next time, y'all have a great week, and we will see ya.